As I raced in Formula D and built different motors, we experimented with different porting. We went from a street port to a bridge port all the way to a peripheral port. Each one of these changing our port timing, which would be a lot like changing cam timing. As we went more aggressive, the horsepower got peakier and easier to make. Yeah, we generated those high numbers. Bigger seemed better, but we were killing our bottom end. So we realized we needed that broad power band. And we actually brought our porting all the way back down to a street port that we designed ourselves. And that gave us the ability with high octane fuel, high boost numbers to use a basic street port to get a very broad power band to fight against those bigger displacement motors with our small displacement rotary motors.